all right guys so today's video is going to be a collaboration video on this look right here this is my smoked out glam look for the new year and this video is a collaboration with my friend here on YouTube her name is Rachel but her YouTube name is makeup by Rach and here are some of the lovely pictures of the look that she has created for this video if you like what you see I will leave a link to her video below but as always just keep on watching to see how I achieve my look All right guys, so let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to show you how I achieved this look. First off, you want to take NYX's Jumbo Pencil in Black Bean and you want to apply this all over the lid, going a little bit into the crease but not overdoing it. Then you want to take a synthetic concealer brush, a flat concealer brush, and you want to blend out the harsh edges and you want to distribute the product evenly over the lid. Now you want to take a skin toned eyeshadow. This is Barista by Coastal Scents and I'm just going to apply that in the crease blending out any harsh edges that the black bean might have caused and this is also going to act as a transition color for the eyeshadows that are coming up next. Now taking the color Marmalade by Coastal Scents again, I'm going to apply this on top of Barista and this is just going to lighten up the area and prepare it for the purple and pink colors that will be applied next. Now taking a mixture of three eyeshadow colors, this is Chocolate Berry, Sketch, and Embark. This is going to give the depth in the outer V that I'm looking for. Also a little bit of carbon will be applied off camera, but this is just going to, you know, give the look a little bit of dimension and also smoke it out a little bit more. Now taking a champagne color as my highlight, this is called Reef Sand. I'm going to apply that to the brow bone and then blend downwards. Taking a clean blending brush and this color, Hollywood Cerise, I'm going to apply that in between the um, purpley color and the highlight color and this is just going to blend everything together creating that smooth transition making sure that there are no harsh lines. Now to add a little bit of more color to this look, I'm going to take MAC's Deep Blue Green Pigment. This came out with the MAC Holiday Sets and I'm going to apply that on the mobile lid where no eyeshadows have been applied. And this is just going to, you know, give it a little bit of brightness but also keep it smoky because it is a dark um, pigment color but it's just very pretty for the lid. From there you want to take any eyeliner, I chose gel, and I'm just going to, you know, create just a base point where my lashes will sit, but no wing. And now I'm using the number 415 lashes from Miss Adoro, and I'm going to apply those, and then I'm going to move on to my bottom lash line. Taking the same black base we used last time and the same concealer brush, you just want to apply a little bit of that to the lower lash line to act as a base. And then we're going to take that deep blue green pigment again with a flat liner brush and we're going to smudge it on our lower lash line.
Make sure you apply a good amount of pigment to the lower lash line so that it actually does show up. And then from there, you want to use either a baby wipe or a makeup remover wipe. And you want to clean up any fallout and also um, clean up any edges. From there, I am lining my waterline with this NYX eyeliner. It's just a gold color. And this is just going to open up the eyes a little bit more. Blend your falsies with your natural lashes and then also hide your lash band with a little bit of liquid liner or gel liner. It's just your choice. Alright guys, so here are the finished eyes. My false lashes have set and I have done everything. And now we are going to move on to the face. So now I am applying a highlight to my cheekbones. This is the Magnetic Appeal from Magnetic Nudes Collection by MAC Cosmetics. I'm going to apply it to the highest points of my cheeks and down the bridge of my nose. I'm also going to use a neutral toned blush. This is Sweet as Cocoa by MAC Cosmetics. It's just going to warm up the cheeks and give a good wash of color. And then from there, I'm going to blend everything together with a clean stippling brush. I'm going to go with a pinky nude lip since the eyes are quite bold. I'm using Jordana's Lip Liner in Coco Loco. Also applying MAC Cosmetics Angel Lipstick and then NYX Butter Gloss and Creme Brulee on top just for added shine. And that pretty much completes the whole look. I forgot one last little step. I decided to add a pop of color to the inner tear duct. This is Dior's Mono Fusion Eyeshadow in 521 Comet. And this was a limited edition shade. And I'm just applying that with a small detailer brush to the inner tear duct. 